how this came about was that Russell Barr, who was the head teacher at Brookfield then, passed me an email from Jethro, uh, just a random one saying, can we get involved? And in the past I've worked with him very closely and we've developed a lot of other areas in our, our business together. So, and I think Russell passed it to me because it was food based. I very quickly got in touch with our catering department and asked Jo Davison to get on board as well because she's our marketing person. Um, we made um, a meeting with Jeffra and started to discuss which way we could do it and very quickly we thought this is a student council project because we are always looking for ways to involve the school alongside our, our department. I had vegetable soup, ocean pie and cheese and biscuits for dessert. What did you make? Well, it actually tasted better than I expected. I think if more care was taken in the presentation of the food on the plate, for example, the cheese and biscuits was in separate packages and you just had to do it yourself. I think if more care was taken to make it look nice on the plate, patients would be more willing to eat food. I could tell that it is you know, the right kind of meal that you have to be serving to make sure they get all the nutrients and things that they need. Well, my personal opinion was that it was better than the school dinners. I had broccoli and chicken bait with some carrots and then I had vanilla ice cream. Okay, what did you think? It was really nice, yeah. I really liked it. Yeah. It's quite similar to school dinners, I think, although there's a lot more choice at school, so you can get a lot of different things at school. There are a number of issues, really. Um, one, we want to make uh, contact with local schools to build a partnership um, to uh, get their opinion on, on lots of different issues around facilities, but mainly um, it's to do with help them helping us develop the meal provision on Nightingale Ward, which is specifically for children. Um, I'm sure there's a better way of us providing the service, I'm just not sure what it is, and I'm hoping that some of these guys come up with a, with a blinding idea. And this is the second one we've done. The first one we did with the primary school children, and we got lots of positive feedback about the food, um, and some good ideas about what changes we could make. Um, and we're going to wait to see what we get from this one and make some recommendations both to Nightingale Ward and uh, feedback to the schools as well. I had a tomato and cheese quiche, it was a nice texture and uh, I also had a star of vegetable soup and it was quite nice and I enjoyed the texture and it was uh, the right temperature when I ate it, it was quite nice. Yeah. School is not as good as this because we don't get a menu we just have to pick it straight away you have to queue up you know it's quite a long thing to do and this is quite easy you have to just pick a menu and bring in things so, yeah i think if a patient it would be all right for a patient um well if you just had an operation or something i don't know if he might have a different but if it's just in a hospital to hurt his leg or something like that yeah it'll be great we had the chicken and broccoli bait it was really nice yeah. i liked the cheese sauce yeah cheese sauce was nice well, we had it with the potatoes, the new potatoes, and we think the new potatoes could have their cheese sauce on it, because we tried it with that and it was really nice. Yeah. I think it's quite a bit better because yeah. more, it's more tasteful and more choice. Than we I had vanilla ice cream and that, that was really nice. I had cheese cracker. First of all, the experience for the, for the students obviously being on the school council and, and then you know, feeling like they're involved in a proper project. Um, and also, if it leads to improvement in the, the food from, for, for the hospital, then fantastic. Now, obviously, we haven't had the feedback session yet, but there's been quite a buzz so far. Have you had a chance to have a chat with any of the uh, kids here? I, I haven't, no, actually, so I'm too busy eating, but, <laughs> uh, but uh, I think that will come out at the meeting next. Yeah, and uh, the food, have you enjoyed it? Uh, yeah, th th there's, th there's been elements that have been nice, and perhaps elements where they're, you know, I suppose like anything, where there might be room for improvement, really. But yeah. I suppose that's part of what today's all about. Uh, it? Yeah, absolutely. Fantastic. Yeah. Thanks for that. Cheers. Okay, no problem. Some general feedback of what you put in your questionnaires, uh, what you thought about the, the orange juice, the soups, the main course, the desserts. So, completely open forum. We won't take offence. Um, some general feedback. Um, I had the ocean pie, which I really liked. <clears throat> but um, I thought it was a little bit salty, it was a little bit salty for me, but it was really nice. And again, the puddings I really liked. The, I really liked the rice pudding. Um, but I think the only thing that I had a problem with was with the mousse. The mousse was really similar to the ice cream. Um, I had the soup for a start and it was lovely. It might just have been like a bit nice if we could have like just soup for the main meal as well. Instead of just the starter. Um, and I had the ocean pie and it was very nice.